19 chic and timeless winter outfits with my effortless style lookbook. I do love an effortless and timeless outfit idea, but I'm also not fond of the cold either. So finding the perfect balance in winter between keeping warm and looking chic is something I've worked on for many years. So I thought you might enjoy seeing a lookbook of 19 current favorites I'm reaching for this winter. There's one surefire way of staying chic, stylish and effortless this winter and that would be to invest in a little cashmere. The joys of cashmere are well known, but when they're sustainable and retailing under hundred pounds, it does make the purchase all that more sweeter. I went for black and cream stripes and I love a good roll neck to keep out the wind in winter. Keep it simple and effortless with classic black cords, add a wool coat or blazer like me to add another layer. And I finished with my classic numero un handbag from Palem Paris. Some of you might have seen my most recent Cezanne haul I did the other week. If you missed that one, I shall add a link in the description box below. But if you did see it, you'll know I am ever so slightly chuffed with this new in jacket, one that I've been wearing on repeat. It's a very timeless Parisian style jacket that somehow manages to feel up to date at the same time. Though it's an easy one to dress up, for casual winter days, I've been styling it like this. It's a bit of a high-low approach that enables me to wear one of my favorite pieces in my wardrobe and stay warm while I'm doing it. Continuing that high-low theme, I like adding in my structured Saint Laurent handbag to contrast the laid-back vibe of my knit. And that's me very much in my happy place. Thinking of Parisian style, actually, I will be launching a special what I wore in Paris, what we did, and a little shop with me French style video this Wednesday on my YouTube channel. So make sure you don't miss that. I can't wait to show you everything we saw along the way and of course everything I wore. So hopefully you will join me for that one too. A new in piece in my wardrobe now with this gorgeous zip jumper that I gratefully received from a brand called Mute by JL. I couldn't resist the shade and that chunky knit done in quite a menswear inspired shape. It really suits my style to a T and to say I'm cozy would be an understatement. I've been pairing it both with laid back jeans and tailored trousers and I do like the look of both. But today I thought I'd share the latter with you all so you can get an idea of how to smarten up pieces like this. I'd finish off this look with either my camel coat or beige tone one that I got from Mango. It does what it says on the tin really, a cozy, casual, effortless style that feels really timeless for years to come. Winter out-out outfits are never easy, I must admit. I'm not sure there's much effortless style going on when your bare legs are turning blue from the cold. So I do try and get the balance between chic, comfortable and warm just right. And a lot of my method comes down to layers. You can never quite tell how warm it's going to be wherever you're going. And I hate to get caught out and spend the evening freezing cold. So I'll often wear a couple of different layers that I can easily check in at coat check as and when I warm up. There's also something quite understatedly sexy about being wrapped up in a gorgeous coat and heels anyhow, so you can easily make the look work in your favour. Something that's proved surprisingly wearable in my capsule wardrobe would be this super soft, and it has to be said, super toasty wool jacket. I love the oversized shape, that high collar keeping out the ice cold wind when I need it to, and a splash of this season's on-trend winter green is the icing on the cake. I often style it with Breton stripes for casual days, and that shade really pops when I wear it against black too. Keep it easy, chic, and effortless with your favorite girlfriend jeans, and I'd add either high tops or smarter ankle boots to finish. A go-to look for me throughout winter is often a great pair of jeans and a jumper, but an easy way to make that outfit feel more chic and stylish would be to add a fairly tailored coat over the top. In this case, I've opted for a favorite timeless camel trench that I bought recently. My other layers are doing the work of keeping me warm, so I tend to choose my coat with looks like this from an aesthetic point of view rather than needing them for practicality reasons. The shade of this trench lifts the outfit visually and gives the right amount of polish to make me feel chic and put together. Another day, another party to head to this Christmas. Well, at least that's what I'm hoping for. But this is definitely the sort of thing I would wear. Skinny jeans, because to be honest, on trend or not, they do make my legs look longer. 
heels as per point number one and styling both with a simple striped shirt and blazer to finish. I think I've mentioned it before but certainly for evenings out I think deep down I actually add blazers almost like a comfort blanket. I like to have something covering my bum and of course the added warmth is always welcome. At least until I've got a few mulled wines into me I guess after which I don't mind my 42 year old bum or the fact that it's minus two outside. Quite the opposite now and very much my daytime chic look. Keeping things simple with jeans and a classic shirt for when I'm craving the feel of cotton against my skin. When I'm opting for super comfort like I am here with my Nikes on my feet, I really like the contrast of adding in a beautiful winter coat over the top. It instantly makes my super chilled outfit feel more chic and put together. But I guess it's a classic high-low outfit idea that never fails. There's absolutely no reason you can't reach for some of your more autumnal dresses in winter. It's just a matter of playing with the styling and adding in a few more layers to make it work for winter. This is a favourite dress I bought from COS a few months ago and despite it having no sleeves, I'm not put off wearing it whatever the weather. I've been styling it a lot with one of my favourite wool blazers tights underneath which nobody can tell anyway and little back ankle boots to keep that line nice and long and lean. Inevitably in winter in England I will need another layer so I often add my matching scarf and if needed a long wool coat to finish. A little tonal love for you now but hopefully sharing how you can look chic and timeless very easily this winter by just wearing lots of variations of a similar tone together. It doesn't have to be white, you can opt for all camel or all burgundy red if that's your cup of tea. But that full tonal look is one easy way to instantly rock a bit of chic effortless style. And if you take a look at the individual items I'm actually wearing here, they're all really classic timeless pieces. I wear all of them a lot individually, but when worn together, the overall look is elevated, stylish and polished. Before you say it, I know I will get cold feet, but I'm aware that lots of you are all around the world in lots of different climates. So this is for those of you who aren't experiencing minus two outside. Lucky you. Milder winters warrant less layers. So I'm thinking there's some of you that will be able to get away with a blouse and a blazer at this time of year. And I have to say, it's one of my favorite looks. I wore this look out for lunch the other week actually, and though the car to restaurant run was a little bit nippy, it was fine once I was inside. Side note too, I've had an awful lot of wear out of these pointed toe ballet flats. Not for everyone I know, but I personally love the shape. And they're so comfy, it's like wearing slippers. And along that same train of thought, I wore this look into town for a quick hair trim the other day. I've had a bit of a newfound love for these and of the stories jeans I bought at the start of this year. So I've been reaching for these a lot recently and paired with a simple cashmere crew neck for a classic go-to look. I like finishing these jeans and a nice top outfits in winter with a gorgeous blazer. In this case, my accrued version from Marcella London. The shade lifts the tone of my whole outfit and the texture adds more depth to something that would otherwise be quite plain. I feel stylish and elegant and really comfortable, something that's all too often forgotten when people put outfits together. Another tonal mix now, but not quite as exaggerated as my white version. This time I've opted for more of a subtle approach, integrating quite different shades of grey into my outfit idea. Again, like I mentioned before, if you look at everything I'm wearing as individual pieces, you'll notice that they're all pretty classic, timeless items. But when styled together, they become a melting pot of effortless style meets comfy winter days. I've really been enjoying styling this coat into my outfit ideas recently, and it always makes me feel instantly polished. Even more casual now, but hopefully no less chic. I bought these ankle boots a couple of seasons ago from Everlane. 
I've worn them in the snow before and incredibly they still look as good as new. Sign of a good piece. Styled here, funnily enough, with a whole host of Everlane favourites. Wearing my recycled cashmere jumper and straight fit light wash jeans. Finished with a coat that's a couple of seasons old from Reese, but they're always worth a peek for winter coats as they have a really beautiful selection. Winter whites again now in this lookbook, but this time styling a lovely wool blend pair of pleated trousers from L'Atelier store. I love the shape around that waistband and they're the perfect length to wear with flats. On my top half, I'm wearing a lovely cashmere roll neck that I sized up to a medium to get that oversized fit and my old faithful double breasted coat to finish. It's a favorite look of mine, blending all those subtle and elegant neutral tones together. And though not ideal when it rains, it does make me feel really chic when it doesn't. You didn't think I would forget my love of camel tones, did you? Of course they needed to sneak in here somewhere. I can never resist. This look is a little bit tonal and a whole lot of comfy. I've had this cardigan in my wardrobe for a few years now, and it's probably one of the most versatile pieces of knitwear I own. I wear it as a cardigan, back to front as a jumper, knotted like this to define my waist, tucked in, a half tuck, and left open with a casual tee. There's so many outfit ideas with just this one piece, I'm thinking my cost per wear is next to nothing by now. Back to my favorite flats, but this time styling them with smarter tailored trousers for a little more polish. Here you can see I'm wearing one of my Cezanne knits back to front as a jumper. I like the understated sexiness of seeing a touch of skin at the back, though that dip to the first button is definitely high enough to get away with a bra underneath. I've added in a cashmere scarf that I got from Everlane. They actually have a gorgeous selection of accessories, lovely for Christmas presents, so always worth a look. And my old faithful tote that inevitably gets piled high with things I don't really need, but I quite like to have along with me. Hopefully you agree, it's effortless style with some of my favorite classics. Another new in piece, very kindly gifted to me by the lovely independent brand called Tallulah and Hope. You might remember them for their gorgeous printed dresses that they do in summer. Well, this winter, I think they've made their best collection yet. And along with their very original prints, they've brought out a selection of velvet pieces to match. I chose this stunning one of a kind button navy velvet jacket. It feels a little bit Parisian, perhaps with a sprinkle of bohemian spirit and styled with casual jeans and ankle boots, makes it stand out even more. On colder days, I would add as many thin but warm layers underneath as possible. No one can tell the difference and it just means you can wear some of your favorite items even when it's freezing outside. Back to my winter green again now, but this time sharing how lovely that tone looks against camel shades. It feels rich and sumptuous and I think the mixture of textures adds even more interest into the mix. Styling with my grey wash straight jeans and a lovely tan tote that seemed me very well over the years. I really hope you've enjoyed my 19 chic and timeless winter outfits with my effortless style lookbook. Don't forget to let me know your favorite outfits I've featured today in the comments section below. And hopefully you'll join me back here on Wednesday for that special edition on my YouTube channel of what I wore in Paris. I can't wait to show you all, so hopefully you will join me for that. Have a great few days, everyone. Take care.